obviously last weekend um, for your, your first mate, single mate, yeah. Yeah, Ricky Burns lost. Yeah. Uh, well, so, have you signed that contract yet? Agent and the Have you signed that contract yet? <laughs> <laughs> a, a new signing. <laughs> we we <laughs> traded him in for Jamie Cox and a crate of beer. I'm currently actually where I am. Well, Agent sure? and you can see. <laughs> <laughs> um, obviously, Ngonda Ngong, put on a phenomenal performance. Yeah, um, yeah. Now that we uh, uh, read recently that Eddie Hearn has a one fight promotional deal yeah. with Ngonda, is that potentially a fight that you're ready for and Eddie willing to make? I want him, Dongo. I want him, but whether Eddie will make the fight right now, I'm not sure. And I doubt Eddie will make the fight right now. But Ngonda is definitely someone that I want. I told Eddie, as soon as the fight was done, um, I said to Eddie, if you got a deal with this guy, I want to I wanna fight him next. Mm. But I don't know whether Eddie and my coach, and my manager. I don't know whether they think that I'm ready yet, but as a fighter, I'm ready, and I believe that I can fight him, and I believe that I can beat him right now. Just finally, next week, a huge fight, 90,000 people, I'm sure yeah. going to be there, and to yeah. Joshua, I'm glad to make six girls. Yeah. Just give me a fight breakdown and prediction of how do you think this fight's going to go? Um, I reckon Joshua wins before round six. I don't know how he's going to win, but I reckon he's going to knock him out. I'm not sure with what punch. I believe that Joshua dominates the whole fight and knocks him out before six rounds. Yeah. All right, David, as always, my man, thank you very much. Thank you. And um, we'll surely catch up with you uh, hopefully next week at Wembley. Thank you. All right, David, for quite a happy to come. Thank you very much. Peace.